People with type 1 diabetes who use insulin may encounter dangerously low blood sugar levels what is during intermittent the fasting, fasting and how does it work? While those with a history of eating disorders may feel unusual anxiety, headaches, nausea, or other symptoms after beginning the regimen. Intermittent fasting is a diet that alternates between fasting and eating on a regular basis. According to research, intermittent fasting can help you control your weight and possibly prevent or reverse some diseases. What is intermittent fasting? Intermittent fasting is a diet that emphasizes when to eat. For the past 25 years, Mark Matson, a neurologist at Johns Hopkins, has been studying intermittent fasting. He says that our bodies have evolved to be able to go without eating for lengthy periods of time, and that maintaining a healthy weight was easier in the United States even 50 years ago. With the internet, TV, and other types of entertainment available around the clock, many adults and children stay up late to watch TV, browse social media, play games, and chat online. Obesity, type 2 diabetes, heart disease, and other illnesses can result from this. According to scientific evidence, intermittent fasting may be beneficial in correcting these alterations. What is the process of intermittent fasting? Intermittent fasting is a style of eating and fasting in which you choose regular times to eat and fast. It works by extending the time between when the body has burned through the calories from the previous meal and starts burning fat. This is in contrast to the typical eating habit of most Americans, who eat throughout the day. Before beginning intermittent fasting, consult with your doctor. A daily method, such as 16 eighths fasting, limits daily meals to one 6 to 8 hour period each day. According to one study, Eating fewer large meals or more little meals may be connected with less weight gain or even weight reduction over time. Another intermittent fasting strategy, known as the 5 to 2 technique, is eating normally 5 days a week and having one 500 to 600 calorie meal on the other 2 days. Longer fasting intervals, such as 24, 36, 48, and 72 hours, are not necessarily beneficial for you and may be hazardous.
Subjects who make it through the adjustment stage are more likely to remain with the strategy because they notice they feel better. What can I eat while intermittent fasting? Intermittent fasting allows for the consumption of a variety of meals, including water and zero-calorie drinks. It also allows for the enjoyment of delicious, healthy meals with others and the enjoyment of the mealtime experience. The Mediterranean diet is a wonderful example of what to eat since it includes leafy greens, healthy fats, lean protein, and complex carbs like whole grains. Intermittent Fasting Health Benefits Research has shown that intermittent fasting periods can have a range of health benefits, including a longer life, a leaner body and a sharper mind. Studies have revealed that intermittent fasting boosts working memory in animals and verbal memory in adult humans, improves blood pressure and resting heart rates, improves physical performance, prevents obesity, and can help people with type 2 diabetes and obesity lose body weight and lower their levels of fasting glucose fasting insulin and leptin while reducing insulin resistance, decreasing levels of leptin and increasing levels of adiponectin. In animal studies, intermittent fasting prevented obesity and in six brief studies, obese adult humans lost weight through intermittent fasting. Is intermittent fasting safe? Intermittent fasting is a common diet for weight loss and chronic diseases such as IBS, high cholesterol, and arthritis. It is not, however, appropriate for everyone and should be reviewed with a primary care practitioner first. People with type 1 diabetes who use insulin may encounter dangerously low blood sugar levels during the fasting phase, while those with a history of eating disorders may feel unusual anxiety, headaches, nausea, or other symptoms after beginning the regimen. Consult your doctor if you begin to experience these symptoms after